one of the major things in any student's life is about placement. So whatever we are studying to set our life in a perfect path, that is important. So do you think that these courses that we discuss, critical thinking and uh, writing, systems thinking, research design, design thinking, so these things act as a catalyst in the process of placement or creating a career to ourselves of any student being a student of an RTI? Yes. See, because when, uh, I'll put it this way, Bharat. When you go for placement, I mean, if I were an interviewer, what I would look at immediately is um, you try to judge. Uh, people try to judge whether the young person coming in for the interview is appearing confident. First, is appearance. Uh, sometimes appearances can be deceptive. <laughs> Somebody can be looking confident but could be hollow otherwise, you know. So that, that comes a little later. That's where the interview starts taking over. You know, when we start conversing, they're able to make out whether somebody is just hollow or uh, whether somebody has stuff in them. So naturally, uh, preparing for the interviews means that you go with uh, confidence because of your knowledge based on what the job is about. You know? So then obviously the confidence is an automatic consequence for, for those. In that sense, knowledge of the subject will definitely be very useful because I oftentimes say that uh, the marks are not a perfect reflection of the academic value and worth of a young person. They cannot directly reflect. But a good set of marks will definitely point to somebody that the student has been reasonably serious with what he or she was doing, independent of whether he or she likes it or not. You know? now, that's a very important signal that uh, a good set of grades and marks will reveal. And even if the student says in the interview, look, I never related to the subject, but I did fairly well. I've got a good grade because I was serious with what I was doing. Now, that's a great character for a young person. Isn't it? So in that sense, knowledge of the subjects will be very, very useful as you go for a job interviews. And, and of course, take your summer internships pretty serious. A time to learn and time to really uh, grow yourself professionally. Uh, Varun, one more point. See, whatever you learn in NRTI, the courses, right? So you should not think that it is going to be only useful for you up till the interview. All right. So you'll have to see how you are going to apply whatever you learn in your work, career. The in career could, uh, could be anything. So you can also be into teaching, you can be into uh, industry, you can be into some social services, whatever it is. How are you going to apply that in your career? That, that is more important rather than seeing uh, with a very, uh, like what LSE used to say, a narrow window of perception, saying that, okay, this will this help for help me for securing a job. No, certainly it will because you are studying in one of the uh, finest institution in India where placements are going to be easy cakewalk and people will just come and pick people and go. Yeah. So you'll have to think as to how we are going to apply this knowledge, especially after uh, some point in a very